Have you ever considered the idea of having a twin? Do you wish to have one? Having a twin sibling is a unique and special bond that many people are fortunate enough to experience. Being a twin comes with its own set of challenges and advantages, and the relationship between twins is often complex and multifaceted. But could it be more complex if those twins were born with different skin colors, one black and one is white, even though their parents are both black? We will find out the story of these twins in this video. Hi, welcome to Hero Summary Channel. This channel is about facts, histories, and amazing stories. When 31-year-old Nigerian mother Stacy went into labor last February, she had no idea what was in store for her. But now, she can quickly tell her twin sons apart, despite being born just minutes apart. Brothers Daniel and David share big brown eyes, but beyond that, the two couldn't look more different. Their parents, Stacy and Babajide, who live in Lagos, are both black, but one of the babies was born albino, resulting in Daniel having dark skin and black curly hair similar to his five-year-old sister Damalade, while David was born with shocking white, pale skin and golden looks. Before we proceed to the journey of these twins, let us first know what albinism is. Albinism is a rare genetic condition that affects the production of melanin, the pigment that gives color to our hair, skin, and eyes. People with albinism like David have little or no melanin resulting in a lack of pigmentation in their body parts. This can range from very light skin and hair to a complete absence of pigmentation. It occurs in all ethnic and racial groups and the levels of pigmentation can vary depending on its type. The chance of being born with albinism typically ranges from 1 in 3,000 to 20,000 people. There are also several types of albinism, and they are classified based on the specific genetic mutation that causes the condition. The most common type, and is also the case for David, is oculocutaneous albinism, or OCA, which affects the eyes, skin, and hair. So going back, the twins' striking difference in appearance makes them stand out in public. And it's not just their parents who have taken notice. Stacy decided to share the unique journey of raising these twins on Instagram. And in just over a year, they've gained almost 18,000 followers. This is a testament to the interest and support that their unique story has generated. The account serves as a platform for Stacy to connect with other parents who have children with albinism and exchange tips, advice, and support. Their mother, Stacy, documented their first steps and their adorable sibling moments. Through her documentation, she was able to capture the different personalities and characteristics of her twin children as they developed and grew. She even had a Minion-themed birthday party for the boys when she knew they loved Minions. She planned a birthday party that was Minion-themed, with decorations, cake, and even costumes for the boys and their guests. The party was a hit, and everyone had a great time. For Stacy, the birthday party was more than just a celebration of her twin boy's first year of life. It was also a way for her to show her love and support for her boy's unique interests and passions. By embracing the boy's love for minions, Stacy was able to create a special and memorable experience for her family. It was not only for the boys, who were happy and excited about the party, but also their friends and family, who were also delighted to see the boys' enthusiasm and joy. For the twins' father, that birthday party was an opportunity to celebrate their uniqueness and individuality. The twins' striking difference in appearance makes them stand out in public. Strangers often do a double take when they see the two brothers together. Stacy says that people often don't believe that they are both hers. I get asked all the time if they are adapted or if they are half-siblings, she says. But they are 100% my biological children and I wouldn't trade them for the world. While the twins' unique appearance may make them stand out, 
It's their bond as brothers that truly shines. They are the best of friends, Stacy says. They play together, they cuddle together, and they always have each other's back. The twins' difference in appearance also makes them a source of inspiration for other families with children who have albinism. However, the reaction of some people goes beyond simple curiosity. Stacy has faced hurtful and insensitive comments, even accusations, from strangers stating that she cheated on her husband. This has been hurtful for Stacy as she has had to endure these accusations and comments from people who do not understand the condition of albinism or the nature of twins. It's not only hurtful for her, but also is an indication of the lack of awareness and education regarding albinism in society. But still, Stacy didn't stop posting online not just for leisure, but to raise awareness among people. Stacy notes that these differences are what make her boys special and unique, and they are what make them who they are. She loves and accepts them for who they are, and not just for the way they look. It's important to remember that everyone is unique and different, and it's not fair to make assumptions or accusations based on appearance. Everyone has their own set of strengths, interests, and talents, and it's important to celebrate and embrace those differences. Stacy also emphasized that the brothers surely love each other, and at the end of the day, that's really the important thing for her. Growing up with a twin who has albinism can be both a blessing and a curse, as it can create a deep sense of connection but also lead to feelings of competition and comparison. Families with children who have albinism often face challenges and misconceptions about the condition, and seeing the twins' bond and normal childhood can be a source of hope and encouragement for them. Their difference in appearance also helps to educate and raise awareness about albinism and to show that it is just a small aspect of who they are, rather than just something that defines them. It can be a source of inspiration and a positive representation of albinism in society. They inspire other families to be confident in their children's uniqueness and to see their children's albinism as a characteristic, not a disability. What do you think about this topic? Are you inspired by the story of the twins and their unique bond despite one of them having albinism? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.